Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today's video, we are going to be eating only 7-Eleven food for 24 hours. And I actually did eating only gas station food for 24 hours a long time ago on my channel. It was one of the first 24 hour challenges that I ever did. But today we are doing strictly 7-Eleven. And the reason I wanted to do this video is because they have a brand new Thanksgiving turkey sub with a stuffing flavored roll. And oh my gosh, girl, it looks so dang good. So I wanted to try it and I was just gonna do like a review on it, but I was like, you know what? Let's take it up a notch and do something funner and eat only 7-Eleven foods for 24 hours. So it is currently breakfast time. We are gonna head over to 7-Eleven and see what they have for breakfast. And I will see you guys over there. Okay, we have made it to the 7-Eleven. Hey. Okay, so I definitely want iced coffee. I think their fresh food is like behind the counter. I kind of want a croissant. Okay guys, so here is our breakfast. We got some little mini baby tacos. They look so delicious. And then we also got us a big ol' iced coffee and I made it a little bit too sweet, but it's still hitting the spot. Oh, I also got, um, I also got this. So we'll have this for probably like a little snack later on. It has apples, peanut butter, and little cheeses in it. Kind of reminds me of the little boxes from Starbucks. Not really, but kind of. Okay, let's try these little mini tacos. Mmm. Ooh, okay, dipped in the chili because... I got some chili on the side. These are really good. They kind of reminded me of the Jack in the Box mini tacos. We do not have Jack in the Box where I live. But I saw someone get the mini tacos on YouTube from Jack in the Box and they look just like these. These are really good. Mmm. Mm-hmm. I have so much Diablo sauce in my car from when I went to Taco Bell. So I'm gonna try one of these mini tacos with the Diablo sauce. It's probably gonna be really good. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep. That was really good. Okay. This is a score. All right, guys. So it is now almost two o'clock and it is time for a little snack. So I'm going to pop open this little snack pack from 7 Eleven. I don't know if you can see it, but it has apples in it, cheese, and peanut butter. Also got Mr. Mello with me. Say hi, Mr. Mello. So it is currently Saturday and he's actually finally getting groomed Tuesday. He hit 16 weeks this past week. So he is finally able to get groomed by a professional groomer which i'm very excited about because i cannot groom him myself i literally tried and he was not having it so he's gonna get professionally groomed and i'm super excited he is getting a treat since i'm having my snack i have this little chicken jerky for him this is his most favorite treat ever he loves it so 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 much sit good boy there you go okay so he's gonna eat his treat while i eat mine so let's pop this open and I am like really thinking about that sub that we're gonna eat later on. Okay, so here is a little snack pack. And let me pop open the peanut butter. Hmm. The apple is super crisp. So, I'm 
trying to decide between two different mukbangs that I want to film. Dang, Mallow, you're already done? You gobbled that thing up, didn't you? So I'm trying to decide between a Chipotle mukbang or a Panda Express mukbang. So... The Panda Express has a drive through so we could do like a drive through mukbang for that. Chipotle doesn't have a drive through so that would just be like a regular mukbang. But let me know which one you would rather see. I will do both eventually, but I'm just trying to decide which one to do first. <laughs> Mellow, that treat was good, wasn't it? Can dogs eat apples? I know they can eat grapes because I think grapes are poisonous to dogs, but can they eat apples? Okay. Those are a little snack pack. Stay tuned. We are going to get the Thanksgiving turkey sub. I'm so excited. It looks so, so, so good. Say bye to Mr. Mello. I don't think he's going to come with us for dinner time. I've also learned that I've been bathing him too much. I've been giving him a bath like once a week and apparently that's a little bit too much, but he just gets dirty so fast because like if you can see his little legs are so short. He has the shortest legs ever and he just gets dirty so fast. But anyways, I will see you guys back at 7-Eleven. I probably said Sheets earlier. Sheets, 7-Eleven, 7-Eleven. See you soon. Okay guys, we are back at 7-Eleven for Zin Zin. I'm gonna try and find this sub and I'm also gonna get a few snacks, I think. We'll get like some gas station snacks. car and I have the Thanksgiving turkey sub in all of her glory and they heated up for me in the oven so it is super toasted super warm and we also got some other goodies that I'm going to show y'all but let me tell y'all what is in this Thanksgiving turkey sub this is what it looks like it looks so so freaking good. So it says that it is packed with shaved butterball turkey, sharp white cheddar cheese, a cranberry mayo, and it has a stuffing flavored roll. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, let's give it a try. Actually, I think I'm going to pull it apart. Okay, That is a lot of turkey. Mmm. Okay. That is really good. How would I describe it? It kind of has like a stuffing flavor to it. You can definitely taste the turkey for sure. I mean, it is packed with turkey. The cranberry mayo is super sweet. And... It has little cranberries in it. We also got a Slurpee. I got strawberry lemonade. Super good. Okay, I highly recommend this. Pretty good roll. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. This is so good. It's definitely a mixture of like sweet and savory because the stuffing flavored roll is very savory and then the mayo is pretty sweet mm -hmm. this is definitely giving me thanksgiving vibes y'all need to go try this this is better than like something i've had from subway <laughs> 
Mm-hmm. Okay. We also got a few snacks. So I got these like peach rings, gummy peach rings. I love these so much. These are some of my favorite gummies. Let's open. So good. Let me know in the comments what y'all's favorite kind of gummy is. I love these. I love Sour Patch Kids. Gummy Worms. Those are probably my like top three fave. Sour Gummy Worms, that is. Okay. We also got these chickpea snacks and I've never had these before but they look pretty good Ooh, they kind of look like Cheetos mmm it says that it's nacho flavor hmm it tastes like a healthy Cheeto <laughs> Like a mm -hmm. I'm definitely tasting the chickpea. They are super crunchy. We also got this unicorn popcorn. I got this because it just looks like a gas station snack. So let's try this. Oh this is this. What it looks like in there. Let's try this. That's something on my face. Mm. Just lipstick. <laughs> okay. Mmm. Okay. This tastes like cotton candy popcorn. It says it's lemon and berry flavored candy coated popcorn. Gluten free. Yeah. It tastes like cotton candy. Or like a bubble gum. It tastes like something I've had before. I can't quite put my finger on it. Mmm, <laughs> that's pretty good though. Some of our Slurpee. Okay, I'm loving the sub because I'm a rewards member at 7-Eleven. They actually took off a dollar from the sub. So we only paid $4 for the sub. So total for all of this, it was 14 bucks, not bad. But I think that's it for this video, you guys. That was eating 7-Eleven for 24 hours. I might go back and get a dessert. If I go back and get a dessert, I will just include it right here. If I don't get a dessert, that's the end of this video. So let's go ahead and do today's shout out. So today's shout out goes out to Supriya. Supriya said, Daisy, can I please get a shout out? I love you so much. I love you too. And then second shout out goes out to Zara. And Zara said, hi Daisy, as usual, I love this video. You're amazing and so hardworking. I just wish the best for you. Aw, thank you so much. I love you both so, so, so much. I love you all. If you enjoyed this video make sure you give it a big thumbs up hit the subscribe button if you're not already subscribed and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys